Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Dollar Tree haul. Let's get started and I'll show you what we got. So first thing, as some of you may know, I think I might have mentioned it in um, one or two of my videos, uh, we are currently redoing our living room and my husband just needed like a little, um, I guess like a little paint set. He grabbed this. I didn't even see it until now when I was unpacking the bags. Uh, but it is a little roller and the little tray and let's see, in the brush and it looks like there's some disposable gloves in there as well. Um, so he grabbed that. And then I got my usual sponges. I know I'm always showing these in every haul. Uh, I seem like I, it seems like I go through tons of them. They actually had the bonus packs. I know I've said this before, but always check if there's a regular item that they sell. Always look around. Sometimes they might have bonus packs of things. Uh, so I happened to find these because like it, it usually comes in a two pack. So these were the three packs. So I have four of them now. So hopefully these will last me a while. I know I've said it before. I probably switch out my sponge sooner than I need to, but. You know that's what happens when you're a little bit of a germaphobe but and i even do the you know throwing it in the microwave for a minute here or there to clean it but anyways i you know i just wanted to have some extras on hand and i haven't gotten these in a while but these are the um aluminum i believe they're aluminum um like the foil or foil pans and these are just some of my, my usual baking pans are getting a little beat up and we've been doing a lot of uh you know baking like you know or roasting veggies and things like that and I just you know needed some extra baking sheets until I get some good ones so anyway so I got they are a two pack in one and um, so I got two of the two packs so I have four all together and you know like I said it's just sometimes it's just convenience to have these and I'll use them a few times and then I will just toss them out and then I needed some uh, just some uh, gloves so I got a the 10 pack of those and then my husband uh, picked up some Irish Spring soap for himself. He, he seems to like that, and it's a two-pack. And then we needed some brown paper bags. I know I, I haven't shown these in a while because they do last a while, but we use these to make uh, popcorn in the microwave, and it is a 40-count package, so lots of popcorn will be made with all of these. Um, it's, a, it's a really easy recipe. You just throw in like a quarter of a cup of popcorn kernels and put it in the bag, roll the top slightly, and put it in the microwave for like three to four minutes and uh, you'll have perfectly popped popcorn. Um, so then next we also have uh, another one of our repeat purchases um, is the toothbrushes. And I always, whenever they have the three packs, I always pick them up because this is a great deal and they are Colgate. So it's a, you know, it's a good brand. As you can see, it says buy two, get one free. Um, so three for a dollar, you just really can't beat it. So I got two of those. And then my husband wanted some hairspray, so he picked this one out. I don't know how how this one is. We've, he's never used it before, so we'll see. It says shine and finish hairspray. And then I picked up these 25% more bonus packs of the plastic silverware. I picked up two of them since they were the bonus packs. I just like to keep these on hand just for, like I said, for convenience. Sometimes just quicker, you know, life gets crazy. And, you know, sometimes just easier just, you know, have these on hand instead of having to wash all the dishes and then I grabbed some snacks for the kids and for my husband I got these these are new uh, peanut butter and jelly the Lance uh, toasty sandwich crackers so I'm sure the kids will be excited about those they sound interesting with the jelly in them and then I got the cheese what is what are these the cheese crackers with the peanut butter got those and then my husband and I spotted these and they seemed very similar to the uh, Taco Bell um, cinnamon twists they look almost they look exactly like it on the package so we figured for a dollar you know we're gonna give those a try you know not the not the greatest uh, snack to be eating but you know oh and it's this multi-grain sweet churros um, so you know and it's a nice a decent size bag it's filled pretty, it's pretty, filled pretty well um, so we're going to give those a try, see how they compare. Not that we go to Taco Bell that often, but um, just to see how they taste and just for fun. Um, and then next, uh, I think last time we purchased these as well. My husband likes these in his lunches. I'll put one in there. And I actually just noticed that this was the bonus pack too. Um, so there's two extra ones in here. I thought the box seemed larger. Usually it is a eight pack. Uh, sorry, excuse me. Usually it's a six pack and this is an eight pack. So we got two extras. Uh, pastries in there so that's a really great deal for a dollar and he likes them you know I know they're not the greatest thing but you know he's a sweets eater and he's my sweets and junk food eater as I know I know I've mentioned that before but so he enjoys them you know as a snack in his lunches 
And then for some holiday stuff, I picked up, I know it might be a little bit early, but I didn't know if they were going to sell out because sometimes I'll wait and then I go back and they don't have it. So um, at Christmas time, at the holiday time, I usually put out like some little candy jars with some uh, little, you know, a couple different candies. And I saw these, these are the Dum Dums, which they do always carry, but these are the limited edition. And it says up to eight limited edition flavors plus the mystery flavor. So there's green apple, Grinch, gingerbread, polar punch, merry cherry, apple cider, sugar plum, sugar cookie, and hot chocolate. So I just thought those sounded so interesting and you know, just something fun to put out. And I grabbed, so I grabbed two of those. And another great thing about the Dum Dums product is these are free of major allergens. And I even believe they're, um, you know, like I said, most allergens, I think they're gluten, you know, gluten free. And these are great for if somebody is peanut free. Um, so it is a really great thing. Like if you're having a party and you know, you're not sure if people, anybody has an allergy or anything, these are great to have as little, you know, just like little favors and stuff. Uh, so the next, they had a few Halloween items left and I picked this up and this is the pumpkin carving kit. And actually why I got this was not just for pumpkin carving, but I usually every year will buy a new one of these little, you know, these pumpkin cutters because when I'm making squashes like butternut squash or acorn squash, it is easier to use a pumpkin cutter than to try to use it to cut it with a knife. So I usually always will keep one of these on hand. So, and you know, and for a dollar, you know, it's just, you know, you got a whole little kit here as well. So just, you know, so that's why I got that. And then I got a few Christmas things. I did try to hold back because we do have a lot of things from years prior. So I only grabbed a few things that I, I you know, were kind of necessary. Well, maybe these are not necessary, <laughs> but these, I just thought, saw these cute little socks and I thought my daughter would love these. These are like the tall, like the knee socks. And I thought, you know, it might be something fun for her to wear to school, like with a skirt when it's around Christmas time. So I got those for her. And then last, my last haul, I showed the tree topper and I went back cause I needed, actually needed two more for my kids. Tree, uh, they have little trees in their rooms. So I went to grab two more and they didn't have the same one, but they had these with the glitter. And I really didn't want to get the ones with the glitter because as we all know, sometimes the Dollar Tree stuff, the glitter stuff of the Dollar Tree is the glitter, there's a lot of fallout. Um, but they need, need, they did need the tree toppers for their trees. So I did get, I did end up getting the glitter ones. I've heard if you spray them with hairspray, it makes it a little bit better. So maybe we'll try that. So I got two of them too in the silver. And then I finally found these. I know a lot of YouTubers have been sharing these on their channel and these are the mason the empty mason jar ornaments so i picked up three of those i thought it'd be just a fun little thing the kids could do a little craft and we can you know maybe date it on the bottom or on the inside and we usually you know they usually do that every year we'll make like some sort of different christmas ornament and we date it and we'll you know we save them and over the years they have like a whole collection and then the last thing was just this these smaller um, Christmas ornaments. I don't know if it says the size. Let me turn here and see if it says. Uh, so there's 15 count ornaments. No, it doesn't say the size. But these were the small, like the smaller ones, because I just bought a new, like a little mini tree for my living room. We have a large tree, but we also recently found this like little mini turquoise tree, and it's so adorable. And it has a few ornaments on it, but I just wanted to add a few more. So I thought the silver, the silver would just be so pretty. And like you can, as you can see, there's the glitter and then there's these that like kind of looked embossed and shiny and then they have this one is kind of sort of like a matte silver looking um you know it has like little stripes very cute so i thought these would just like be a cute little accent for the tree so that was everything i hope you enjoyed checking out what i got at dollar tree this time i actually did take a lot of footage inside the store because like i said i kind of refrained myself from purchasing a lot of christmas stuff because we do have a lot from the years prior you know, but that doesn't say, that doesn't mean I necessarily, I may not go back and get some, you know, cause they're always adding more stuff. But for now I was trying to hold back. And, you know, like I said, I just kind of, kind of got the few things that I needed. And, uh, but I did take a lot of footage in the store. So I'm going to, going to insert that at the end. So you can check that out and, you know, don't forget to leave your comments below. Tell me what fun things you have found at Dollar Tree, or if you've tried any of these things, the cinnamon twist or the dum-dums, you know, let me know if you've enjoyed them and tried them. And until next time, um, I hope you enjoyed and I will see you soon. Bye.